Okie dokie, folks. I am terribly sorry about the lack of a camera this evening. You don't get one because I am having significant technical issues. So you can just listen to the sound of my voice as I narrate the tomfoolery in front of you. Um, and if anybody can tell me why, when I plug in a USB camera, everything crashes. Or not crashes, I lose every single audio input and output. And I have no idea why. And this didn't do it yesterday. There were no updates between yesterday and today. There are no pending updates. So I'm kind of at a loss because the camera does both a microphone and it does it does video and audio. So I don't know which driver is having conflict with which thing. Iron, how are you? Prince Eugen. What's going on, guys? I, I'm kind of I'm kind of bummed out right now because uh, this is not doing the thing that I want it to do. My microphone works. My capture card works. Those USB devices actually work. So I guess it's not an audio input device, but I mean, it's got to be because. Uh, no, that uh, dude, I'm telling you, everything is messed up. Everything is so messed up. I plug in a USB cable and I lose every single audio input and output. And I don't know why. Dude, I I'm telling you, man. Yet again. Um, yeah, I really, I really don't know what is wrong because if I if I plug in my webcam, every single audio driver, input and output, like I don't have speakers, I don't have microphone, it's it's all gone. I um, I'm kind of annoyed by the whole thing because I really really have no idea what is going on. And I hope the I hope the audio is actually all right because I think something else since what did I get? Yeah. Um possibly though I'm not sure. I don't have really anything to hook up with. Uh Yeah, I don't I don't know, dude. It's just it's one of those things where it just I don't know. I mean, I've, I've tried like when the, when the audio stuff drops out, I've, I've tried checking the drivers, the drivers are all there. Everything is recognized, but I lose all the audio inputs. Uh, I can't join the convoy for some reason. Oh uh, man, th this is, it's just, it's, it seems to be a series of issues that are getting worse and worse and worse and worse. So you can't join the convoy. Carter JN, how are you? Welcome on in. How you doing? Um, so Money Sniper, what is what is your? Per Do you need an invite to the? Man, I'm I'm kind of kind of bummed out by this whole thing. All right. So you have an invite. That's a sus bus. All right. But yeah, I, I don't know, guys. I'm I'm having I'm having a lot of issues. Uh, I got Modern Warfare from a PC. Time to wait for two days for it to install while it eats away at my remaining storage. That game is huge. The game is gigantic. Restart your Xbox. Okay. You restart your Xbox. And I don't know which particular race we're going to do. I don't know which race we're doing first. 
I mean, we've got the Reservoirio Sprint right here. But yeah, um, yeah, Modern Warfare. That is that one. What like 120 gigs? How big is that one? Festival playlist. Also, why is this now? Why is this different? know why that's different hundred and forty six gig that is a very large game although we do have a wheel spin so let's check this thing out yeah I'm I'm just kind of all right 175 K that's not too bad it's just it is it is another issue in a long line of issues that we're apparently having All right, so that's a bunch of that stuff. And of course, there's a whole bunch of rivals where they're all going to be beating my time. So we're just going to, we're going to delete that. We're not even going to look at that. It's and festival playlist. Two so we do have, I would no be right here volcano, pointing directly above me. Only going to have 250 gigabytes left. Ooh, yeah, that's definitely going to need another GMC SSD. Typhoon. It's kind of like the GMC Cyclone. Uh, we have the Holden Tirana. What do we got in the store? I have the Koenigsegg, and I have the Tirana. Why don't we just buy a wheel spin? Let's, let's, let's just buy a wheel spin. Also, guys, is the audio for the mic all right? Because I don't know anything else that's kind of going on. A Datsun 510. A B-class Datsun 510. My God. Okay, all right, because this all this all started with significant audio issues and everything. I, I'm i not even that good at those times. Uh, sell it. Shotmaster Flex, how are you doing? All right, so... The Datsun 510, you say... I don't even I don't even know what race you would be. Oh, I have two of them. I don't even know what race you would be doing to try to beat my time because none of them are very good. All right, you're in. Okay. So how about we do the very first festival playlist for the big 10 pointer? It's going to get us an Audi RS six and yeah. So this is going to be a B class Datsun 510 and I need to, I need to tune this thing real quick. Positive attitude and more money you can solve. Uh, you know what money would be a uh, money. I would just buy another computer. But like, dude, I have no idea what's wrong. I am I am fully at a lack of anything. So what do we say, B-class? I'm just gonna auto upgrade this thing because I just can't be bothered right now. I'm just, I'm, I'm thoroughly annoyed. So I'm just going to auto upgrade this thing to a B-class. That's what I'm gonna do. RB. Yeah, um, all right, right when you are ready, we will, we will kick off. We've got six people in here. Ekbalam took me three attempts. I mean, Ekbalam, anybody should be able to just stuff my time, no problem. 10 seconds to join, okay. All right, if, uh, okay, that's gonna put us at seven, so we're gonna start doing the, uh, all right. which means I should probably look into a better tune for this thing. Um, it's in tuning. Fine tuning setups. Let's see, for B class, it's going to be... 
B class, top speed, circuit. All right. So it's going to make it a little bit heavier, a little less lateral Gs, but it's going to give us more top speed, a lot more power. Um, how about... All right. Or with that one. Yeah, I'm I'm sorry about the lack of uh camera. I wish the camera was on. I wish I could actually plug the camera in without the entire system completely losing all of the audio inputs and outputs. So now crap, I don't even know where I am, man. I'm just all messed up right here. I'm I'm just kind of I'm kind of bummed out to be perfectly honest. Like, all right. Reservoirio Sprint, EVP, switch to normal event, EVP. We'll go A-class. Yeah, let's just, let's just do the A-class type thing. So we'll do the A-class thing. We will, we'll give it a shot. Um, yeah, I don't even know what I can hook up for like a, like a virtual cam. And I could probably set up my second laptop, but I'm not going to get into that now. All right. So right is ready. We're going to do an A class. It's going to be a sprint. And we're not going to be able to do the festival playlist at the moment. I don't even know if anything works, man. I, I don't even know if, if anything actually still works. All right. Uh, no, 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 no. So that still works. All right, the audio output for that still works. Yeah, I I really really don't know. Like I'm I'm fully at a loss for this one. I don't know if it's the drivers, I don't know if it's the hardware. Hmm, interesting. All right, so Reservoir Rio Sprint, the MX-5, Holden Malou, RX-7. GMC Cyclone, the Bel Air, and then the AMC Javelin. I know who's coming in last. I'm already at the bottom of the numbers. All right. Let's see. This thing does. Do, 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 do. All right. Apparently, we need a big run up. We need a big, big run up because we don't we don't have the legs down low which I I have yet to figure out how to actually tune for getting some legs underneath this thing right off the line. Not, I don't know how to get off the line. Dead Sniper at one. We got Webb in second place right there. Damn it. There we go. Round the corner. grass
I mean, it sounds good. This car sounds awesome. Uh, I'm going to flip the wall. Yeah, damn it. And there you go. It kind of drifts into the corner a little bit. Like the back end still gets a little, it gets a little loose, but it was, it was significantly better than I thought it was. It's got way too much top end and I need to tune out the top end on this thing, I think. Uh, that was, the, we were, we were neck and neck right there. So we were 10th of a, um, yeah, less than a 10th of a second apart. You know, the interesting thing is I can't even get the I can't even get the camera up on this thing. You know, I really wonder if it's the I see something. I, I can't get the I cannot get the camera working for the laptop like it this thing doesn't even light up make about half the stream all right okay Luther has joined us we've got uh mr right in one more time so let's see you know what hold on i'm gonna all right see i don't like i i can even just pull from Even if we go, yeah, I don't know what that's going to do. Okay. And yeah, we'll fly with that. We'll fly with that. See what that does. All right. So what do you guys want next? What do you, what do you desire? Do you like, why does that camera not even work? That's the thing that is perplexing to me. Do we want some off road? Do we want some on road? Like, uh, like, like where, where are we, uh, where are we at with this? money how are you doing what's going on a stadio somebody wants a stadio oh. and i believe we still have it set up i think we still have it set up for the four laps so why is this not Why is this not? Display one. 
choose a source from the drop down at the left. Yeah, it's not actually. Nothing about this makes sense. Yeah, this is weird. It is going to be another A class. Yes, this will be will be an A class race. Uh, oh, trust me, I'm still wearing a flannel like an idiot. It is over. It's like 90 degrees right now. I have flannel. I've got my green screen set up behind me. I've got I'm. I just I can't run my camera because it's going to crash everything. You guys, you guys won't get any audio. And actually, I don't even think the capture card is going to work. So the capture card's not going to work. The microphone's not going to work. Nothing will work if I plug in this camera. And I believe it's got to be something. It's got to be something with the. It's got to be the video. It's got to be the video driver. Because if I plug in. But that wouldn't make any. Man, I don't know. I really, really, really don't know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tweak something real. Um, you know what, dude? I, I don't. Like, had I thought about it, I could have tried to run everything from my laptop. Loader. When I plug in the USB, I lose all of the audio inputs and outputs. I have nothing. And there's no way for me to get them back unless I unplug the USB to the camera and completely reset the computer. It's just, it just doesn't work and I don't know why. Incognito. Thank you very much for the follow. Hope you're doing all right. Uh, that's... Do, 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 do. No, no arrow. Breaks and we gotta we gotta tweak all this stuff around a little bit. Completely change it around. Hunt this right up there. Drop that down right there. We'll do. This, I don't know if this is going to steer or not, because this truck has uh, a very difficult time trying to steer. But I'm going to give this a shot. Uh, loader, no clue, dude. I have tried. I show all of, even, even with the inputs and the outputs gone, it still shows all of the devices in there. My camera for the laptop will not even register on anything other than the camera app on the computer. Norma from SOD2. All right, so we're going to do a Stadio. Full system reset. I've, I've, uh, I've turned it off. I've turned it on. I've, um, I have no idea. I need to get, uh, I need to dig out one of my other cameras which I think is around somewhere. I'm going to try another camera. I'm going to try... If it's another camera, then I know it's not the hardware. And I know you guys want the Estadio circuit. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Let me... Let me just make sure we have all of the blueprint options. Full reset. Like, uh, I, I haven't gotten that far because this all came about right as I was setting up for stream. So I kind of don't have the time. I didn't have the time to do a full reset with all the resources intact. All right, Stadio circuit. I'm going to use this F100 to hell with it. So I really, really don't know what's going on. And I'm kind of, I'm kind of really bummed out about it because You know what? I even forgot these. See, th this is this is how much. Oh yeah, no, I did. Um, I I did a complete power down. I tried starting it up with everything plugged in. I tried starting up with everything unplugged. 
and there was there was no differences so i'm gonna have to go in i'm gonna have to figure out and you know what honestly i don't even know what i'm looking for in terms of a a conflict of any sort so like i'm i'm smart ish but when it comes to really diagnosing this stuff Well, I did that before as well. That that I actually did when I was having issues uh, Monday. So Monday, Monday is, Monday basically started off our issues. There was a Windows update and it just, there was like issue after issue after issue after issue. And I found out that what had happened is it reset all of the settings for one of the filters, the the compressor. Uh, we still can't turn. Why can't we? This thing just won't turn at all. But I tried uninstalling, so I, I, I uninstalled and reinstalled the, the microphone, which did nothing. I I uninstalled some drivers. I re-downloaded the proper drivers. Like, it just... Yeah, I'm kind of... I'm really at a loss on this one. And um, I don't know... I don't know what I'm going to do. Because if, if it's not so glaringly, obviously staring me in the face, then I'm just kind of, I'm kind of lost on it, you know? So this is going to be prime example of another vehicle that's not good. Or at least not tuned properly that I can I can do. I mean it's it's quick but it just can't, it can't make it through the corners because I don't know if it's the differential or if it's the sway bars or what it is in this thing that just prevent it from actually kind of taking a corner. All right. I mean, at least the microphone sounds good now and I'm, I'm trying to add like in the in the Logitech capture software, I can't even get the get the laptop camera to recognize. So I I really wonder. I don't, but I don't know if it's like a like a video driver kind of issue because the video driver knocks out all of the USB devices, which I I just I don't get. I really don't get. And I don't know if I can roll back the windows. Yeah, I don't even think I can roll because some of the drivers that are installed won't actually allow you to roll them back like some of the windows updates that you can do. So you can, you can select any Windows update you want, 
and usually within reason you can uninstall it and then reinstall it or allow windows to do an update so i'll have to go back in i'll have to see what messed up on the third lap and that was all she wrote well that's okay i, I messed up on the second turn so don't feel so bad <laughs> You guys are lining yourselves up for a grudge match. You guys are going to go for like some hundred lap grudge match at some point in time. Yeah, that's loader. That's exactly the audio stuff is exactly what I did. And it just it it's the same it, it's i'm i'm going to have to try again tonight but if it's if it's going to be the same outcome i don't know what some dunas blancas do we want some dunas blancas Yeah, I seriously, seriously, seriously don't know. I'm kind of just grasping at straws at this point in time. All right, we'll go, go 60. Up the D-cell some more. Drop that, up that. Uh, no. What kind of car do we want to use for this? So this one's going to be, this one is going to be another A-class. It's going to be another A-class sprint. To hell with it. Let's just jump in this thing. You'll only drive the GTR on pavement races tonight to give you more chances to beat it. Uh, I don't think I've ever tuned this thing properly. Hearing. VW Golf. Oh, wait. Hold on. Then, hey, why not see what that does? Soften up the front, loosen up the back, springs, a little bit more stiffness on the springs. Arrow brakes, differential. <laughs> all right pop this up to there drop this down here all right, let's see what that does flavio souza how are you doing what's going on how is everything this evening hope you are well hope everything is going good Sorry for the lack of a camera. I am having some significant technical issues at the moment. All right. So we're going to do that. We're going to see what that does. I don't even know if this is going to be a good tune or anything. All right, let's pull it up. Let's see, Acer, Purified, Voice Console, Input Source, Output Source, okay. Microphone Mode, AI Noise Reduction, Noise Reduction, okay, that's fine. 
monitors integrated monitor uh we're, we're giving it a shot we're giving it a shot we're having i, I was having some significant there's always that too there there's there's always that too But yeah, we're uh, we're giving it a go. John Gibbs, one bit. How are you? What is going on? Thank you very much for the cheer. I hope you are well this evening. I am sorry that my camera is out of commission. Uh, I'm having some significant technical issues and if I if I plug my USB camera in the the entire input and output for the audio uh, actually just gives it up and I don't know why I haven't I haven't been able to figure it out at all. Uh, 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 uh. There we go. Well, you know me. But no, like there is significant technical issues. Like if I plug in the USB device, everything stops being recognized. So like the audio for the capture card would go out and probably the, the input for the capture card as well. The microphone stops being detected like everything stops functioning and basically i would not be streaming or I, I i just i wouldn't be able to be streaming because nothing would work uh very very strange stuff and i really truly don't know why i don't i don't know uh what the issue is and I just, I haven't been able to figure it out. I've, I've been having audio issues this week and I don't know if this is a continuation of those audio issues or, or what the deal is actually. Never happened to, yeah, th this is a first for me. This is definitely a first for me. I haven't been able to figure it out. Damn it. Shoot. Come on. Okay. Yeah, uh, I've been I've been working uphill like all week long and i really don't know what the issue is going to be so as far as let's see so windows itself got an update on the fourth which that didn't create any issues how about some driver updates real tech software component that was yesterday so what happens if I uninstall the real tech stuff? Um, well, it's, it's always the same three devices I've had. I've had the, I have the, the USB microphone, the USB camera and the capture card, and that's it. And this does have three of the USB 3 ports. So uh, that is one thing that I did not do. I didn't try to, no wait, did I? Which one is this one on? Not yet, but yeah, if, 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 if it's a USB port going bad, that would be, yeah, less than a year, I think, uh, which would be unfortunate. All right, so this thing is actually not terrible. 
could be the power supply failing. Well, that's that's all I need. Th like this is this laptop is probably when did I get this laptop? I mean, the laptop is less than. I mean, it's about half a year. I mean, just over half a year, probably. Did I get the extended warranty with it? I don't even know. That's... Actually, we want to stiffen that up. Brakes. We want a little more front bias. Give that. Yeah, let's do that. Oh yeah, no, it's um it happens every time I just so I have the I had I did one at a time and it was when the camera was plugged in every time. Pro Serpine, how are you doing? What's going on? All right. How is everything with you, my friend? What is up? What's shaking? Well, other than the Among Us. Well, I, I don't know if it's the camera, though. That's the thing. Because I can't get the camera on the laptop to get recognized by OBS. Like, OBS will not pull up the camera. And my... My camera software will not pull up the camera. So I don't even really know what's going on there. It's just, it's perplexing. No, it's it's not it's not OBS. It's my for whatever reason when I plug in the USB camera to my laptop, it then completely kicks out every single audio input and output. Let's go for a nice tropical cross country then. Money sniper is back. Yeah, it's not OBS, so I don't know if it's a Windows driver, and I need to narrow it down, and I need to double-check and see if it's actually the hardware itself. So I really don't know, and it's actually quite frustrating because it shouldn't really be... Yeah, it shouldn't be this... It, it shouldn't be messed up like this because it was literally just working yesterday. Like, we were just working yesterday. So we're going to do an A-class. We're going to do an A-class off-road. Well, I ju I'm just going to get another camera. And I've got another one floating around here somewhere, but I have to dig it out. I have to find it. So I can figure out if I plug in a different camera, if that's the issue, or if it's, is it hardware related with the camera itself, or is it software related like drivers and everything else? Man, I, I, I don't even know. I, I don't even know. But with that said, it actually appears like the, so what had happened is it looked like all of the filters had actually disappeared and weren't actually working. So like the noise suppressor, the noise gate, and all of the other filters that I use for OBS were just not being applied to the, to the microphone. So I truly have no idea if that's another issue or 
if it's if it's something that goes hand in hand with the current issues so damn it there we go all right let's see if we can't make this thing Yeah, needless to say, it's it's very frustrating and to not have like even a direction to go in other than just plugging stuff in, seeing if there's any oh crap, any exclamation points in the device manager, which would indicate that there's an issue there. But like it doesn't it doesn't show that anything is off. And Windows 11 actually doesn't have any repair tools anymore, believe it or not. So you're, you're, oh crap. You're basically left uh, trying to diagnose stuff on your own. So it doesn't, like the repair tools just, they did away with them. And I don't know why, which is kind of bizarre. things gets really loose suspension which i like because it can actually take some bumps really really nice like that just to be able to land that one and just keep going like it does that's awesome suspension right there yeah Hilo, i have no idea man no idea it is just one of the most frustratingly bizarre things and if i'm gonna continue to plug in a usb camera and it it just craps all over everything. Like, it, it, it legitimately makes it so that it no longer recognizes any audio input or output sources. In, in the laptop, not even, I'm not even talking about OBS. This is before we even get to OBS. Because you open up OBS and there are none of the sources in the dropdowns. Like, when I, when I actually got OBS up and running again, I had to manually go in and select all of the other stuff all over because it had basically forgotten it. So. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what's wrong and I really kind of have no idea how to go about fixing it other than plugging stuff in. So Realtek audio driver. Series of unfortunate events complete? What do you mean? All right, Reborn Leader is back in with us. So, okay. Fallout GMC? That's actually pretty cool. All right. Maybe just the USB connection. See, I'm going to, like, when I have the opportunity after stream because that's that's why we were running late into stream i was really trying to get everything up and running and i i can't even get so here's the here's the really really bizarre part my laptop camera the camera that's built into the frame of the laptop doesn't even work so i can't get obs to recognize that camera and i don't know why it's just the Acer front-facing camera. Doesn't work. No idea why. Yeah. Yeah, none of that stuff is actually working. All right. So everybody seems to like that... Uh, do we do do we do the Grand Pantano? I don't know if we did the Grand Pantano. But we could do another sprint race. Yeah, I'm gonna try plugging different USBs. And it was I would 
uh, I would connect one USB device at a time. So I would connect my Blue Yeti microphone. I would connect the capture card. Everything was stable. OBS recognized, excuse me, OBS recognized everything. And then the second I put the USB camera, plugged it in, everything took a dump. And it stops being able to see any of that stuff. Hopefully no more problems appear on your end. I'll be good. Have a good one. Uh, District dude, thank you very much for popping on in. I appreciate it. Uh, and for you guys, please go check out District. District was playing Mud Runner last night. That's more Mud Runner right there. Uh, that would be more <laughs> the 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 video that is playing that is right above where my head would be. Uh, absolutely, man. You you deserve it, dude. District is an awesome dude. District is a very, very knowledgeable mud runner individual. Trying to drift an all-wheel drive cyclone on the roundabout doesn't work. That just means you need worse tires and more horsepower. All right. So we're going to go Grand Pantano. We're going to make sure that we are set for... See, we haven't, we haven't done this one in a while, so we have to turn the collisions off. See, override existing. Okay. So the A-Class Grand Pantano Sprint, we're going to do... You know, oddly enough, oddly enough, I actually had some reasonable luck. Where'd it go? I don't even know where it went now. El Tigre. Oh, this guy right here. This little fella. This thing actually... Boot scoot boogied. So, I mean, why not? I made some adjustments. I'm going to give it another shot. See what it does. Oh man. And it doesn't help that it's it's still it's 7:30 at night and it's 80 well at least it says it's 81 degrees. It's probably a little bit warmer. But the added heat to the frustration doesn't doesn't really help things. And I've got to work tomorrow. So this will be Saturday number two in a row. But then again, Saturday number one was simply because I was covering for my boss. Because he had uh, something come up. Oh, both of you going toe-to-toe -to -toe with a Nissan GTR. All right. Arby's got the Cyclone. I love the Cyclone. The Cyclone in this, I can't wait to get, I can't wait to get the Typhoon. All right. This is... All right. I like it. I like it. Why is it that a Pontiac Trans Am, a 70, what is it, 77 Trans Am, is doing way better in a in kind of a a, a half butted sort of like I'm gonna throw this tune together and maybe it's actually gonna do something. Yeah, see there we go. We yep, we lost it right there. Alright, it's the top end. Alright, I need to figure out how to get this thing. Uh darn. Oh wow, no, this doesn't steer. Ooh, that doesn't steer. So under hard acceleration into a fast corner, this thing does not want to steer. I mean, it's stable. It's very stable. But I have to, I have to jack the brakes to get the front end to come around. So why is that? 
it was doing so good before and i really only made minor adjustments to the differentials and it's it's going to be the it's it's oh darn it's definitely going to be the issue in the differential on this one at least that's what i can sort of narrow it down to oh we can't uh can't break into a corner either Yeah, we actually have to hit the brakes to, to kind of bring the front end around. So I really don't know what the heck I did to the differential because this now handles like a completely different car in the... Uh... in the corners. Well, it was a valiant effort. It was a valiant effort. Coming to the dark side with the GTR. Is, uh, is that what's going on? All right there, Paul Walker. Okay, what kind of race do you guys want to do now? I, I did not say anything disparaging. There was just somebody there who had a very obviously silver and blue Nissan GTR. <laughs> Forza. Forza. Shock Jockey, how are you doing? What's going on, my friend? You got to drop out Arby. Oh. I can bike. Woo! Does that feel good? <laughs> yeah. Mexico, you want to do the Mexico circuit. All right, we can do the Mexico circuit. Okay. All right. Well, thank you for jumping in and racing with us, dude. I really appreciate it. I always have a good time when you're here. Mexico circuit it is. And if we do end up All right. So we'll do we'll do Mexico circuit. And the cool thing about this is if we still keep at 6 it's going good. Uh, racing is all right. Racing is all right. Thank you very much, my friend. All right. So let's get in this co-op. No, not co-op. We want PVP. And we're going to do... Going to make sure that collisions are off on this one. Yep, they are. Uh, racing is racing. I'm having significant significant technical issues unfortunately all right so it's gonna be another a class it's gonna be an a class circuit i don't know what do we want to run oh dude th this is this is like significant technical issues exactly Oh, excuse me. So the long and the short of it is every time I plug in my USB camera, the computer will then instantly drop out all of my input and outputs for the audio. If you're watching for pizza, so I'll probably hop back on. All right, JR Strang. You know what? I'm going to do this thing. That's what I'm going to do. Yeah. So if I plug my camera in, I lose all input and output audio sources. And for some reason... I can't even get OBS to recognize my my laptop's built-in camera. Even though I can use the camera app, Logitech Capture won't recognize the... Big Mac, how are you doing? What's going on? Yeah, even Logic Capture won't recognize the onboard... Let's 
see. Yeah, so everything is just... Everything's a mess. Yeah, it's not even in the... Not even in the system settings. So I don't know what's up there. Yeah, just the Acer HD front-facing microphone, or uh, front-facing uh, camera. And it's not even, yeah, it's not even picking it up. So I don't even know. I don't know what's wrong with that. Like, every everything. Everything is just a mess, so... I'm gonna try running with this thing. I don't know if this is gonna be any good. I think I've only used this in um, when it's actually called for in the festival playlist, and that's about it. Handle's good, though. But how are you doing, Big Mac? What's uh, what's going on? Oh, wow, that, that actually really handles good. But then again, it just doesn't have a whole lot of Ah, uh, crap. Oh, that's because it's front-wheel drive and rides up. All right. BMC Cyclone just going right on by. Yeah, this wasn't exactly the best car to pick. I'll tell you what, how we do that 10-point uh, Datsun race right after this one. Because I really wouldn't have an issue going for the GMC. The GMC Typhoon is the 20-point vehicle of uh, of the week. And yeah, after after racing is wrapped up this evening, I am going to go back in and try to figure out what my problem is with my hardware or software potentially. I think I've got another USB camera around here. So if I plug in the second USB camera and it does exactly the same thing, then at least I know it's not my hardware that's faulty. It's going to be the, uh, it's going to be something with the drivers or something with an update, anything. Okay. No. Oh, really? <laughs> Molar Jason, how are you doing? Oh, crap. We have another lap. I almost forgot about that. Uh, yeah, I'm having some significant technical issues, and uh, I don't know what's wrong with them. Like, it is, it is baffling and perplexing. Ah, you know what? I I could be doing better because I just completely missed that checkpoint. <laughs> so my camera's my my camera's not working. I missed a checkpoint. Can't tune a vehicle to save my life, but you know, hey, what whatever works, whatever works. But yeah, if I if I plug in a USB if if I plug in my USB camera, it will create havoc and all of my audio inputs and outputs will actually disappear. So I I won't be able to to like hear anything. So like even even the system sounds like something going beeping bopping booping on the laptop is just not going to work. So yeah huge technical issues and it, it was kind of one of those things where i only just figured it out like i was running late to stream because i was trying to get everything all all sorted 
and yeah the second that i plug in the usb camera everything kicks out but um all right right thank you very much my friend hope you have an awesome rest of your weekend good racing as always so with the sound settings the thing about it is it's not that it just causes issues with my blue yeti mic which i use as my primary input and anything else all of the all of the inputs and outputs disappear so like it it has when you go to click on the little uh the little speaker icon in the lower right hand side it just says there are no audio devices whatsoever yeah exactly that's what i thought too so I, at first i thought it was some kind of conflict but then you know thank you very much my friend i am gonna i'm gonna keep uh i'm gonna keep working on it i am gonna keep working on it and i really don't know what we're actually going to be coming up with as the final solution if i if, if you know what honestly hopefully it's just the hardware because if it's just the hardware and i and i plug something else in and it works then i can just go to best buy tomorrow after work pick up new camera but the thing that really actually kind of starts to worry me is the fact that my onboard acer because I use a Acer Nitro laptop, the built-in, the built-in camera is not getting picked up for some reason. Like OBS does not recognize the camera. And it's very strange. Even though the camera app recognizes the camera. So it's unusual to say the least. Very unusual. All right. So this was that Datsun 510 race. It's a B class. Next race will probably be your last. All right. I don't know how late we're going to go tonight because I still actually really want to sit down and try to figure out what's going on with the stuff. All right. So we're going to do this one. And thank you, everybody, who has popped in to race. It has been very cool. Greatly appreciate it. I don't even I don't even know what kind of racing we're doing on this one. Although I do like that livery on that uh, Ford GT that's right over there on the right hand side. Yeah, it is. Um, it is very very strange, and I truly hope that if I plug in a second USB camera, that everything is solved, and then that's just maybe it's an issue with the USB plug it's an issue with something i'm gonna juggle around different no actually did i i can't remember if i tried a different usb port but i'm gonna try a different usb port and if that doesn't solve it if the different camera doesn't solve it then i have to start trying to dig into seeing if it's more like the drivers and stuff like that The only thing that recognizes is the camera app. That's it. I don't even know if I have... Do I have XSplit on this? I don't even think I do. Yeah, I don't even think I have XSplit Vcam on here. All right. Oh, this is dirt tires. Why did it put dirt tires on this thing? I don't know. Yeah, I don't have XSplit on this.
I sign in with Twitch? I don't remember if I signed in with Twitch. I don't even remember what I signed into. Hey, hey, um, <laughs> well, I mean, I think, uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger says it's best, said it, said it's best when he's, uh, he's as Conan. But we're not, we're not lamenting anybody's anything or hearing the lamentations of anybody's anythings. But we have some, uh, we, we've been having some significant technical issues this evening and trying to get stuff, trying to get stuff sorted and it's just not getting stuff sorted. So if you notice, there is no camera and that's because there is a lot of technical issues, a lot of technical issues. Basically every time I plug in my camera, I lose all of the inputs and outputs for the audio sources. So no microphone, no speaker outputs, nothing. I, I hope it's something simple too. All right, Molar Jason, thank you. Oh crap, 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 crap. Thank you very much. Have an awesome rest of your evening. Be good. We will see you when we see you. And uh, yes, sorry about the technical issues here. We're just, uh, yeah, I'm just trying to get by for the night. It's, it's, <laughs> it's really a bummer when stuff just doesn't, oh crap. Oh, this thing does not turn. Yeah, it's, it's definitely a, definitely a bummer when things do not go according to plan. Oh, jeez. Well. I was up there in a couple positions. Ah, Matt Max, what is going on? How are you doing? Thank you very much for the cheer. I hope you are well this evening. How is everything going? Uh, I can I can tell you that uh, I, I certainly hope that uh, <laughs> your evening is going better than my evening. We'll put it that way. Because as you can see, we're we're lacking certain elements of the stream. Oh crap. We're lacking certain elements of the stream. Uh this is a Datsun. This is a Datsun 510. This is a, I think it's a 1977. 1977 Datsun 510. It does look a little bit like a Volvo. I will I will give it that. It's significantly smaller than a Volvo. But I do like the I do like the boxy Volvos in these. They're they're actually pretty fun. You can get them tuned right. You can get them set up right. They're they're actually really neat. Either that or you get one of the Volvos, big old turbo on that bad boy, and away you go. No. No. I mean, kind of. Like, just sort of boxy, but other than that, not so much. Oh... Uh... At least they're driving on the correct side of the road. Yeah, so it's it's a little bit, a little bit different than a Volvo. Although I do I do really like the Volvo wagons that are just like those bricks on wheels. There's something oh crap, there's something very appealing about that style of automobile. And mostly, it's also not a Saab, so there's that too. Uh. And at least it's not a Saturn either. So there's that. All right.
All right. What's uh what's what's the next race? And you know what? Had I realized that this was like uh on on pavement, maybe I would have chosen a different kind of tune that didn't have off-road tires. Oh, sus, 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 sus. Sus? Who's sus? Uh, I went and saw the newest Indiana Jones movie, and I highly recommend it. It was fantastic. All right. Win a street race in a cult classic. Cult personality. Living Color, awesome song. Awesome, awesome song. But yeah, that uh, that was a great movie. I highly recommend the newest Indiana Jones movie. I don't even know what that's saying. I truly have no idea what that horn is, is attempting to say. And then I went for lunch and had a uh, a really delightful crispy crispy fish sandwich, I believe it was. It's actually quite good. Uh, yes, yes, it had uh, it had disappeared. Uh, it was taken away by aliens. It was either so. Here's the thing: it's either stream without the face camera, or. Uh, no stream at all because there's no audio inputs or outputs if I hook the USB into the, into the uh, laptop. So I plug in the USB camera, all the audio inputs and outputs disappear. It basically stops thinking that I have speakers and a microphone. Though, I still have no idea why OBS does not recognize my, my onboard camera. Like, it just, it doesn't see that it's there. And if somebody actually figures it out, I'll, like, I'll, I'll gift you a copy of SnowRunner. <laughs> I'll buy the complete, I'll buy the complete, uh, complete SnowRunner. There you go. Have at it. Which, I mean, you, you might actually want to fix it, or you might just not want to fix it. Also, I can't go around corners. Yeah, see, that's what everybody is kind of saying. I need to find... I know I have a second, um, a second USB camera around here, and... Once I plug in the second USB camera, if it does the same thing, it will eliminate the fact that I have a hardware issue. Although I kind of hope that it, I don't know, I, I kind of hope that if I plug in another USB camera and it doesn't do the same thing, that means the USB camera that I have is no good. And all I have to do is go to Best Buy and get another USB camera, probably a slightly nicer one, or at least that's the idea. But I really don't know how to sort out a driver issue on this thing because I don't have anything that's showing some kind of conflict, but it's it's very... Owen! What is going on? I mean stuff. Things and stuff and things and stuff. USB connector manager. Device is working properly. Events. Resources. It says no conflicts. Conflicting. 
All right, so I'm gonna have to plug in that camera and then double check the uh, and see if it if the USB stuff actually says that there is a conflict. All right, so we get the Audi RS6 Avant, which I think I already have one of these things. It's not exactly tuned all that well. Uh, I am having significant hardware issues. All right, who said who said Volkswagen? Who said Volkswagen? I just gotta. Well, loader, it doesn't, it, the, the only, I can't get the, I cannot get the onboard camera to work either. That's the thing. So I am, I am just having significant hardware issues where, let's see, batteries, Bluetooth, camera. Yeah, it just it's it's telling me that the huh. All right, money sniper, thank you very much. But yeah, I can't I cannot get the onboard camera to work either. The only time I can get it to work is with the camera app. And that does that does kind of nothing for me. Pop, pop, All right. We're going to install that, do that. Oh, that's what that says? I, you know what? Honestly, I never even in a million years. Owen, I appreciate it. I hope you're doing good though. I, I hope everything's all right with you. All right, do desktop. Do not launch on machine startup. Install. Let's see if this works. So I certainly hope that I'm not going to have to restart. Hmm. All right. So we got, we got an Avant and a wheel spin. Well, at least another wheel spin anyways. Yeah, I did have XSplit VCAM previously, and it created a delay. So I had to compensate for the delay. All right, next in the festival playlist, what do we have? Class act for sure, win a drag race for treasure galore. An old, so win a drag race in a challenger. All right. Uh, photograph the 1982 Porsche 911 Turbo 33 at the Horizon Rush. Then there's all this stuff. All right. So I just installed XSplit VCAM. And let's see. Reasonably priced cars. I don't know what that means. Classic muscle. Speed zone, seasonal playground. Man, there is some stuff I just don't want to do. All right, calibration, running hardware tests. Calibrating allows us to, you're on your way? All right. Calibrating allows us to improve the performance for VCAM. VCAM will one run hardware tests to check your system. Oh, yes, absolutely. Ori, there, there is, uh, yeah, we have plenty of room here. And we can keep on doing the arrow boy. Right? That's that's a that's another car right there. The treasure you have to class the car before the drag. All right, camera. All right, so that works. Select a camera that you want to use. Next, be that. All right, so sign in. What did I use for, hold on a second.
All right. No passwords for that. You have arrived. There you are. All right. All right, sign in. What am I signing in with? Was it Google, Facebook? I forget what my XSplit password actually was. That's that's the annoying thing right there. And I certainly hope uh because I actually did I paid for the the lifetime subscription. All right. Okay. All right, I'm going to I'm going to try one more thing here. I have arrived, although slightly strangely. All right, hold on. Background, remove the background. Camera settings. All right. So this is going, this will be a slight bit of work around. Yeah. Yeah. I know. Right. Well, the, the, the lighting on this thing is completely. All right. Uh, well, let's see. Hold on. Do, 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 do. All right. So that's that. And it's, it's still, it's still going to be a little bit weird because it's going to try to actually, it's going to try to pull out the background. Hold on. Let me, let me see if I can kind of dial this in just a little bit. Original. Properties, configure video. Oh, wait, so it's going to configure video that way. Yeah, I know. It's kind of. All right, so we can do. Is that better? No, that's still not better. Um, Basically, I'm going to have to play with the settings and I'm going to have to. This is this is our cheap workaround. This is. This is our cheap workaround for, I mean, apparently I'm half in this realm and half not of this realm. Language general, show virtual cameras, new. Um, uh, where the hell? Settings, performance, automatic, screenshots. I had it and now I can't find it. Is there a way, uh, on the Forza map, let's see. We're right by the Marathon and the Street Scene Outpost. So the... I want the original background. Where the hell is my settings? Oh, there it is. No, see, if I... Um... Yeah, basically, if I remove the chair, it's going to remove the... going to try to remove the microphone. 
Ooh, chair. So... webcam properties okay there we go uh, uh no it's okay so the white balance is all right i found it now Rawr! yeah that's not gonna do it um a ghost me no oh refuses to show us all right so when we jump into the next um the next festival playlist so let's let's pick one let's do let's do classic muscle and this is going to be horizon oval circuit well the, the thing about it is um this because it's using a uh like a virtual camera i don't know why all right so we're not going to remove the background we're not going to do any of that but it, it's still all right i think the issue is gonna uh i'm gonna have to mess with other stuff basically so it's not going to be set up properly 100% because it's still um, <laughs> having all sorts of issues tonight, Nika Fernandez, having all sorts of issues. All right. Festival playlists. What kind of cars do we have? Classic Muscle. All right. Yeah, we'll just we'll just jump right on in. We'll, we'll we'll go for it. We are having uh, all kinds of issues with hardware. My camera. So probably because the green screen settings are not right, I'm gonna have to adjust for the. Let's see. Four sixty. That better? I gotta remember to write down what I had. Because that was with the previous camera. So it's uh the the gamma is four sixty. So okay, this is working better. We're, we're in a better kind of, and does my mouth line up with the words that I am saying? Because we had an issue there previously as well. It should pull you right into the game. And we're gonna do this one. Yeah, you're, you're good. Okay, awesome. Loader, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Um, good suggestion on the X split. I don't like because it's yeah, I don't have I don't have really any uh any good B classes for these cars. So it's pretty much gonna be just kind of whatever I have. So <laughs> But yeah, with the X split, because it's a like a virtual camera. Yeah, A class, but this is on the festival playlist, so I uh, may have missed it since I had to step out, but your body language is telling me today. Uh, so primarily, primarily the issues that we're having with our hardware is is really what uh, what we're kind of going with. Oh boy. 
Uh, this is five laps of this, apparently. Ah, crap. Sorry, loader. This is five laps of this, apparently. So, loader made the suggestion of XSplit VCAM, which is a virtual camera, because OBS was not detecting my camera. And OBS was not detecting the onboard camera. The Logitech software was not detecting the... Oh, crap. The, uh... Yeah, Logitech wasn't even detecting the onboard laptop camera. The one that's actually physically part of this laptop. So... Man, we're just gonna... We're just gonna drift and wall ride. That's what we're gonna do. So... What happens every time I... Oh, crap. Every time I plugged in my USB camera, I would have all of my audio inputs completely drop out. Like, they weren't even... Ah, loader, why do you keep turning up there? Uh, and why am I in first place? I don't understand that bit. So every time I would plug in my camera, what would happen is the computer would just decide that it no longer... Oh, crap. It no longer had audio inputs or audio out. Whoa, there go the jets. Audio inputs or audio outputs. And like, I I really try to put the effort in to have my stuff actually look decent, to have everything on camera, um, you know, just everything look how it should. And, and the fact that it wasn't working like at all was, very frustrating. And we actually won that one. I have no idea how. But yeah, the, the fact that nothing was working right, and that's why I look a little bit on the green side. There is a green screen behind me. I had to adjust some of the settings for that, which I'll have to change back if I ever get... So I need to find another USB camera. But how how's your... Uh, how's your Friday going, Shot Master Flex? Mad Max! Uh, you drive better here than... The cars do not handle how they should or drive how they should in State of Decay 2. It's just... It's just how it is, man. It's just how it is. They just don't work how they should. And I am not familiar with the maps, and there is no mini-map to, to really, really reference to know where you're sort of going. So, but yeah, like I said, look at this. It is, it is 80 plus degrees and I'm still wearing my flannel. Told you. Okay, so D2 drives amazing. It's just arcade. Yeah, see, th that's the thing for me. Like, I, uh, it's way arcadey. Wind Horizon Oval Circuit. Oh, okay. It's, it's very, very arcadey. All right, for me, it's going to be all or nothing. It's all power. Power! And then we're just... This thing is big boaty and... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, this is not good. That's not good. Long, hot, tired, not enough AC at work. Uh, we're cranking now. Every AC is on. 40,000 BTU, beached on the couch, and I'm not moving. Not a bad idea. Oh, uh, hey, hey, you still play Forza 4? Whitefield boss fan? How are you doing? What's good today? What's up? It's a survival sim. Not well, I mean, they could at least make the, the driving moderately, you know, survival simulation-ish, kind of. Yeah, I, I can't steer this thing at all. Although it does have really decent acceleration and accelerates way better than any of the cars that I've tuned or put together. You get a general lead build, full recreation. Awesome. And it's got the horn and everything. Um, 
driving driving was terrible and i'm not gonna catch up am i we're just gonna we're just gonna bounce this thing off of every wall imaginable because every corner that i go into realistically i probably should have taken any car but this one like it's got a really good straight line run but yeah oh forza horizon 4 oh 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 crap 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 there we go hey as long as it's across a flag right checkpoint's a checkpoint Here. No. Basically, this is just an entire drift fest. He was up at Clark's? Oh, no kidding. Did I see that? Oh, crap. He actually, he dropped his price of his cameos uh, by 50%. And that was actually, that was actually really kind of cool. Oh, man. And this is where everything goes sideways. Yeah, this thing is not staying in a straight... As long as we get... As long as we, we, we cross the finish line with the points that we do, we're going to win. And that's a huge plus. Clutch won't engage on the compressor. I have to check the AC in my Camaro. I, I fired it up the other day and I went to check the AC because I filled the, I topped off the AC at the end of last season. I did a cabin filter, the um, AC recharge. I have to check for leaks and I'm really, really hoping, I'm really hoping that it's not the evap core. Well, I think you have a slightly better car than any of us because <laughs> we're <laughs> we're just bumping and grinding over here. Well, it's not um, it's not one of the new Silverados. Those things always leak in the condenser. I'm really, really hoping that it's something simple. You and me both, and I was right behind you. Good job, though. But I'm just, I, I, I am hoping and praying that it is not the evap core because the windshield has to come out, the entire dashboard has to come out, the interior has to come out, everything has to come out. It's like driving a boat. <laughs> I know, right? But hey, we won, and we don't have to do that again at all. Thankfully. I really just want to get the GMC Typhoon. Like, the Typhoon looks cool. All right, how many points we are? We are two points away from that bad boy right there, the GMC Typhoon, the all-wheel drive SUV. And what do we have that we could do? So reasonably priced cars, C600. Oh. <laughs> I do have one of those too. Let's do the next one. What's the next one? The You're talking about this one here? Let's be reasonable, Prince Eugen. Ooh, unlimited buggies. Okay. All right, we can do, we can do this. Let me see what I, let me see what I have for cars that I actually want to use. And I don't know if I have any of these in a C-Class. Hey, there's that Volvo. Uh, it, it is C-Class. It's called reasonably priced. So I think it's probably below... And I don't know. We can take the Polaris side by side. 
So, but it, it's C class, and it's got some some various caveats to it. Mustang SVO would be kind of cool. Oh, I have a Cobra R. I do have a Cobra R. Do I have a Cobra R, Mustang Cobra R, set up for C-Class, maybe? Because there's a lot of other cars that we have access to that are in C-Class, but I don't think they're going to kind of cut the mustard. No, I don't. And I've got like three of them. So, <laughs> um, basically, it's a whole bunch of. I think they're 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 fairly inexpensive vehicles, is what it's meant to be. Not enough Fox bodies. Ninety three Fox body. Ninety three Fox body uh, GT. That would be that would be a cool car. All right, so tell you what, let's bring this bad boy right over here and let's do a tune. We're going to, uh, I'm just going to use, I'm just going to use somebody else's tune because I don't want to, I don't want to jump through hoops for this. Grades and tuning, fine tuning setups. We want C-Class. And we'll do circuit. So what do we have? No, wait. Fine tuning setups. Search. Not A class. We want C class. C class circuit. All right. I think they make these all all wheel drive. Apparently. Yeah, that that that's a really cool shaped car. Perfectly shaped car. Right. I can get behind this. All right, we're going to do that. Uh, um is it in any particular order? Unfortunately, not really. So I'm just going to use this this particular car. And if you guys are ready, let me know when. Because if you go over here, uh, my dad had one, and it was the best little car until he blew a rod out the bottom. Gotcha. Yeah, so what you can do is... See says view eligible cars. All right, Prince Eugen, when you're all set, when Ori's all set, uh, then we'll jump right in. I like, I, I do like the Fox bodies, though. Um, my uncle had a black Mustang GT. I don't know if it was a five-speed. I can't remember. He who is without oil throws the first rod. Compression. Eight and a half to one. How do we see eligibility if we're not the host, though? Um, I don't know, actually, because you should be able to see all the different cars. Are you looking for something in particular? Because this is this is the car list that it brings up for me, at least. I mean, the Mini. The Mini is almost right there. Those are good. The Celica GT4s. Those are actually really good. Supra 2 liter. Oh, the MR2, the ever the ever popular Toyota MR2. Or you can go with uh any number of uh Volkswagens. And no, just two Volkswagens. All right, so Ori, uh you're ready. Are you ready, Ori? Prince Eugen's ready. 
And Loader, I imagine that you are also ready. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. Yeah, I like to move it. I like to move I'm not it, moving move much of anything. It has been a long day. Uh, how do we check? I'll be as ready as I can be, I guess. All right. We're going we're gonna to give it a shot then. We're going to give it a shot. All right. We've got a high of 87 tomorrow with a 50% chance of rain and thunderstorms. Yay. All right. So we're going to do seasonal championships. Let's be reasonable. Yeah, Chod Master Flex. I'm really not looking forward. I got to work tomorrow, too. So I'm going to be stuck inside again. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck to us indeed. I mean, this is going to be a fairly decent platform to go with. So I, I hope it's all right. 85 and sunny in California. Of course it is. It's going to be 80s and rainy, and the humidity is gross. We got a great big convoy. Twinkie Diggy, how are you doing? Um, you know, fighting an uphill battle. Fighting in the the never ending uphill battle. Uh Kurt Carl. That one. Go give Twinkie Dinky a follow. Valorant, COD, all those first person shooters. Do it up. Very good dude. You owe it to yourself to give him a follow. I mean <laughs> I dub the the Jolly Rancher Toyota. Oh, dude, there's so many cool colors. Just finished some dinner, watching my baseball team play. I am very hot. I've got fans going. I am having all manner of technical issues. We start. We started on Monday with microphone issues. We've moved now to. <laughs> we've we've moved now to camera issues because if I plug in my USB camera, what happens is I lose all of my audio inputs and outputs. Box body bros. All right. Back to the 90s. Wow, that Crown Vic has a hell of a wing. Oh, that's a nice looking Fox body though. Like, I, I did nothing to, like, visually tune this thing whatsoever. Well, those... Ah, crap. These guys are just kind of duking it out together. But, yeah, I've had nothing but technical issues. Apparently, I did an update on Monday, and it completely changed my compressor settings for my filters and OBS. So it was garbage. And then... I had to use my USB camera, the microphone on that. And that got me by on Monday until I actually figured out some of the issues that I was having. From there, we've now, like just today, I don't even think anything downloaded or anything updated. And we've just wound up in all kinds of issues. So if, if I need to find another USB camera, and if I plug it in and it works, it's a hardware issue. If I plug it in and it does the same thing, it's a software issue or it's a... Well, I will I will check the USB ports. I'll check the USB ports. Like, I'll, I'll try putting... So if it's actually a, a busted USB port, that's going to be a downer because this computer is probably just over half a year old and that's it although i did get it at best buy and i think they keep everything on file like when you when you get an extended warranty or something like that did i get an, i don't know if i got an extended warranty i gotta check god that'll be bad if i can't even remember if i had an extended warranty pretty sure i did on my tv but yeah um technical issues yeah usually for the most part 
we can kind of figure things out but lately it has been the biggest like it's it's absolutely all of the worst stuff possible <laughs> and it's stuff that's not it's not as simple as just <laughs> turning it off and on again <laughs> oh <laughs> If I didn't laugh about it, my head would explode. Yeah, the IT club. I love that opening intro to that show. Also, one of the other things that happened when the audio went buggy, it was almost like it stopped using any of the filters. So any of the background noise filters, the noise gates. Callum! Callum Waits, how are you doing? What's going on? It is going. It is going downhill at a rapid degree. We don't have a seatbelt, and there's probably no steering wheel. So there's that. Um, and you can see the, the, the camera is a little bit wonky. Uh, loader, made, loader did make the... Uh, because OBS was not recognizing the onboard camera at all, and I have no idea why. You're built for handling, not for speed. So Loader had a really great idea to check out uh, because I did actually buy a lifetime a license to XSplit VCAM and OBS will recognize. Yeah, how you been? What's new? What have you been up to? Oh, okay. All right. See, I, I have... So... Fun fact, I have XSplit VCAM on my old laptop because that's what I used before I had the green screen. So when I got the green screen, I was able to use the filter. Oh, it's top speed type tomfoolery. Top speed all the way, my dude. Uh, I don't think this car really has any kind of top speed to it whatsoever either. What are you driving, anyways? The fact that all of the drive guitars are actually really getting in, getting into it as well, is moder. Oh crap! This high-speed corners are not a thing. Brakes, 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 brakes! Uh, apparently, somebody did not spring for the good brakes. No good brakes. That's one thing I'm kind of spoiled on. Although, I think I do have to do the front brakes on the Jeep. I really don't want to do the front brakes on the Jeep because that means spending money. Because I already spent money on new tires for the Camaro. And it's not as easy as this. I can't just go out, do a couple laps, and get some cash. Uh, just getting sorted. Uh, got my first tattoo, and now... Finishing fours. Oh, what'd you get for a tattoo? Do tell. I, um... On my, right around my, my birthday in February, I had a really big one done on my chest. Like, large tattoo done on my chest. Oh, wow. We're actually really cooking around along. Loader, no! Oh, God. No. Oh, damn it, damn it, damn it. Oh, this is bad. Did it count? Did it count? Did it count? Oh, it didn't count. Damn it. That's that's a bummer. Oh, you did? That's awesome. That's really awesome. Oh, congrats to you. Yep, I did show it to Hilo. And, and mostly because I don't want to get banned on Twitch. I don't want to just go lifting up my shirt and flashing everything around. But then again, Twitch is weird, and I might and I might not. Nika Fernandez, thank you very much for that. I will get right to that. All right. Buzz! What is going on? How are you doing? So nice to see you. How is everything been? Uh, we are surviving. We are attempting to get by, mostly because we're having all manner of technical issues.
Actually, this this does handle good at low speeds. And I will I will grab that hydrate in just a moment, Nika Fernandez. I need to attempt to not crash again. Also, you can tell by the odd color palette on my camera that that is where we were having issues. Um, this is this is the one where it's a it's a C class, and it's a oh, sorry, didn't mean to bump you. Um, it is not classic muscle. It's um. like reasonably reasonably priced cars or something all right come on we need to make up at least a handful of spots here all right Okay. There we go. <laughs> we made up two. Yeah, this, this one, it, it's a very interesting selection of automobiles that we have to choose from. Nika Fernandez, thank you very much, my friend. So I went with the 93 Mustang R. <laughs> I took the corner and it went wide. Did loader, you just, you went spinning. <laughs> I went wide and that was one of the ones where the checkpoint wasn't right up against the concrete barrier. So, have you done the classic muscle? Yes, the, um, the one that starts with the oval in the stadium. I believe we did that, yeah. All right, so this gives us a, <laughs> gives us a skyline. <laughs> um, so, pink Toyota. Where is your pink Toyota? Okay, it's called Let's Be Reasonable. Toyota, 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 Toyota. Almost caught second. Um, yeah, that was that was a hell of yeah, that was a hell of a race. And actually, this car is reasonably good. I love what you do for me, Toyota. That is an old... Oh, there you are. All right, you're way, way ahead. Christian, what is going on? How are you doing? We're hanging in there. Why is my horn like that? <laughs> Use the SBO Mustang. Um, I am just attempting to get by. My my odd color palette is due to technical issues. All good, just finished all of them seasonals. Um, actually, so this means we get the GTS. Now, we get to go and collect our GMC Typhoon. I do like that Porsche, though. I do like that Porsche. All right, GMC Typhoon is ours. I like the wing on the back of that cop car. I'm not going to lie. No, that Toyota is actually a really, really nice car. Those things handle like they're on rails. Hoi. Actually, that's not a bad idea, guys. We're over here. We're just kind of taking up all of the <laughs> kind of block on the road. All right, tell you what. We're going to get that. You've been tuning that cop car for a bit. Awesome. Handles great. It's just a grandma's car. Well, those things they had, what is it? The boxer four is all they had. Exit photo mode. Oh, that's a good color. I like that color. I like all the candy colors that they introduced into, um, when they had the hot wheels DLC. Even though the Hot Wheels DLC really wasn't all that good, I do like some of the things that they added, uh, which, you know. All right. Guys, I am wiped. I don't know about you, 
but I am exhausted. Absolutely exhausted. So... What time is it? Well, it's almost 9 o'clock. It's almost 9 o'clock. One more? All right, one more. Next weekend, I'm taking a tent on my bike and going camping. Oh, nice. How far away are you going, Loader? I'm going to go to Maine. I'm, I'm going to go to Maine in two weeks. You have a payday van now? Oh, okay. So that's... It, it definitely looks like the A-Team van a little bit. Just the colors. We'll do one more, and then we'll we'll wrap things up for tonight. We'll see who uh, what kind of race you guys want to do anyways. Do you want to do off-road? Do you want to do pavement? Like, what would you like to do? You want to do S1 or an S2? Go into a Jellystone Park and Southern. Those are cool. Those are actually really cool. All right. We'll split the difference. We'll go with an S1 because S1 actually isn't too, too bad. And uh, like S1 Sprint, S1 Circuit. What are we thinking? The last time I went to a Jellystone was up in the White Mountains when I went camping with my cousin and I had an absolute blast. Even though it rained overnight and he has one of those pop-ups and the top, the roof of the pop-up is all fiberglass or it's all plastic or whatever the hell it is sprint all right we'll do a sprint how about how about the good old copper canyon you like the good old copper canyon we're gonna do a good old copper canyon Mm-hmm. all right i feel terrible for doing that that's that's kind of an awful sort of thing but uh yeah it poured overnight we stayed dry but because of all the rain beating down on the roof of the pop-up camper, there was no sleeping to be had because it was like a megaphone on the inside of that thing. Uh, great niece and great nephew love the Yogi Bear. Dude, that's awesome. That loader, that's so cool. Oh, loader, when were you going to, when were you guys going to see the new Indiana Jones? Because please, I want you to tell me if you liked it or if you didn't like it because i highly recommend it i am not giving any spoilers prince eugen dropping out gifted subs to the winnemum mage sabin of figaro joe toy gaztron and redbeard 505 thank you very much for that i really appreciate that I really do appreciate that. Thank you. Um, it has been a hell of a day. It, is, it has been a hell of an uphill struggle. All right, we're going to do PvP. There's just going to be a couple of us. So we're going to do S1. Let me just make sure that I have this tuned right. Blueprint. Collisions are off. Confirm. All right. Exit without saving. Okay, so it's going to be an S1 sprint. And we're going to go Copper Canyon. So Copper Canyon, S1 Sprint. I don't know. I don't know. I like this thing. I do like the Forza Edition Porsche. That's an awesome vehicle. Um, Let's see. I do like the Huracan. That's a cool car. But you know what? Uh, I'm going to stick with the... Actually, we've never raced the McLaren, but I, I don't think the McLaren's tuned. I'm going to go with the 911 GT3 RS. That's what I'm going to do. All right. So this one's going to be the last race of the evening. So hopefully I don't bone this one up. <laughs> because it's just been that kind of night. And and let's think about who we're going to raid on out to. So. Also, it's like a billion degrees. All 
Oh no! All right. Let's um. So we get to pick Ori back up again. Let's back out, rejoin the convoy, so everybody can be on board for the last one. Gastron, how are you doing? Hope you're doing all right this evening. I am broiling in my own juices because it is it is it is piping hot over here. Also, what do I want for breakfast? I have to go to work tomorrow. This is the main event of the evening. It's time. Yeah, it's really hot. It's um actually it looks like it just dropped below 80. It was low 90s earlier today with the with the sun up. Completely humid. And it's supposed to be 50% chance of like thunder showers for tomorrow. Okay, so once it gives us the opportunity to, let's back out of the race, let's rejoin the convoy so Ori can jump in, and then we'll do this all over again. Yeah, it's um Yeah, we get to uh because it's taken a while for the game to actually populate itself. Ooh. Not right now. I have a couple of fans that are facing me. Well, one fan that's facing me and one fan that's actually exhausting out the window. Because the Xbox and the PlayStation 5, you wouldn't... You'd, you'd be very surprised at how much of, like, a mini heater. Um, no AC right here right now. That's because streaming. And all of the electrical equipment that's in here for streaming. All right, so we will reform. Oh, there's Christian. All right. So this was going to be our last run of the night. All uh, right, so then we need... We need Ori, and we need Loader, and then we're going to do S1 Sprint. All right, there's Loader. Just waiting on Ori. That's actually a really nice car. That's actually a really, really nice car. We all had green car. <laughs> yeah, it's some shade of green. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like my green Skittle. It's pretty much what this thing's like. Like a green Skittle. Oh, that's a cool Ferrari. That thing is neat. On my way. All right. There you are. And if everyone is ready, we're going to do an S1. Hopper Canyon Sprint. That is, that is an awesome blue. Oh, that's a cool picture right there. I wish there was a way to get rid of the traffic in the background, but like, not gonna lie. Uh, this is a cool picture. I gotta turn the contrast down though. I think I have some of the colors up a little bit too high. Okay, so if we are in fact ready, we can give, uh, can't fast travel to you guys, so photo app. Okay, well, um, when we wrap up the race, we'll do a photo with everybody, and then we'll just, uh, all right, so PVP, S1, Copper Canyon Sprint. How come you can't fast travel? All right, that's what we're going to use. And we'll do we'll we'll try to remember to remind me. Oh, okay. Barely play. That's no excuse. I mean, it is an excuse. <laughs> uh, high of high of 87 tomorrow with a 50% chance of rain. Not going to be in a super fast vehicle, but in a fun one. Okay. So you have the Lotus Azige S. So we get the A. I love 
So Prince Eugen, I love that AMG. That AMG GT Black. That thing is awesome. All right. And I forgot to look at what type of Ferrari that Christian is actually driving. I was looking at tuning guides and I really need to go back to the drawing board with all of my cars concerning tuning. Yeah, I hit the brakes way too hard in that corner. This Porsche, I'm, I'm very happy with how this Porsche came out though. Oh no! I love the way that that AMG looks. This doesn't have a very aggressive sound to it. What the hell? I don't know what just happened there. That was that was some straight up snow runner level of uh tomfoolery right there. Not gonna lie. That's like it's like somebody ran over a sign in snow runner and things got wonky. Oh crap, crap, crap. Oh no. Damn it. Alright, keep going. <laughs> no, nobody saw nothing. <laughs> nobody saw nothing. <laughs> Nobody saw nothing. All right. I do have to I, I do have to tune this thing some more. I like how it, it handles actually. And that's a problem that I I get a car that is, even if it's at not at the top of the performance index, it's tuned perfectly for all of its gear. And it, it revs great, it drives great, it shifts great, and then I get it, and it becomes slower. Even though it's got more horsepower, um, it just, it ends up being slower for some reason, and I don't understand why. Like the RPMs don't climb as fast, the miles per hour don't climb as fast. But if I get something like, I, I will never forget the Andretti VW Beetle. That thing is fun. And I didn't want to upset the balance on that car because of how fun and how good it drove. Like it handled beautifully and adding more power to it made it like more skittery and sketchy. That was a good race. That was a very good race. Went to space and back and <laughs> Dude, you shot into the orbit. <laughs> John Master Flex, I hope you also have an awesome weekend. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna throw some pictures up on the Discord if you guys uh, if you guys have the Discord, or if you, oops, if you don't have the Discord, there is the Discord. We can keep in touch in that way. If you're up to anything, if you're at any car shows, if you have a particularly nice dessert at a restaurant that you want to share the image of with people. Oh yeah, the picture. Yeah, 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 we gotta take a picture. All right, Ori is all the way up there. Loader's all the way up there. Let's, uh, let's converge on Ori. And also, let's, uh, let's find a nice, like... There we go. Prince Eugen, don't even tell me that you dipped out. <laughs> Alright, there's Ori. Where is Prince Eugen? There he is. <laughs> all right. Uh, Christian's all the way over there. Oh, yeah. Perfect. 
perfect, perfect, perfect. So Prince Eugen is coming. Christian's coming. King Trucker, how are you doing, buddy? What's going on? Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna take a picture right on the edge of the water over here. I mean, we're all a bunch of supercars. We can park however the hell we want to park. Ish. All right. There we go. Uh, doing good. Just barely got off work. All right. Wait a minute. One, two, three. Hold on. All right. Try that again. There we go. Oh, that's a. Oh, that's a cool shot. All right, we're going to, uh, light, dark, light, dark. Yeah, actually. All right, tell you what, we're going to kind of pull back just a little bit here. We are the green man. <laughs> actually, you know what? Tell you what, let's just get right. You know what? Hold on. We're going to, we're going to take the, uh, and do the front. All right, there's that. That's a cool shot right there. I think. Uh, are you going to do a stream walk around of cars and coffee? I um. So they didn't have one in July, but I definitely, I definitely need to do that. Your Gastron, you are correct that I do need to do that again. That was a lot of fun, and I absolutely should do that. I've only had a chance to go once this year so far. All right, then we'll do this right over here. Oh, that's a nice Shelby. But no, you you are right. I, I do need to do that again. That was a lot of fun. But um, like all cool things, this must come to an end. And I do appreciate you guys being here. I appreciate you guys hanging with me while I experience all manner of wonderful technical difficulties. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll do another one next time. We'll, we'll, we'll get more creative next time. But now the real question becomes, who do we go and raid? Who's out there? I mean, District is out there. He is playing... Um, <laughs> actually, the Molar Jason was just here. So, Molar Jason was actually just here. Um, he is also playing Forza. So, why don't we go and do that? Because that's... That'll be kind of fun. So, if you guys remember, uh, that was the Molar Jason that we had uh, been talking to earlier. And uh, let's go give him a raid. Um, OG Jawafawa, who's on? You know what? I'll, I'll I'll have to add that one. Gracias por el stream. Take care, Nika Fernandez. Thank you so much for popping on in and being here. Really appreciate it. Kilo, thank you for being here. Thank you everybody who hung out. Thank you everybody who uh, who hung in there with our uh, our trials and tribulations and our and our ups and downs and our technical hotsits. I certainly appreciate it. So we're going to wrap things up. We're going to try to be back on Monday, and I'm really hoping that I get things sorted by Monday. We'll go from there. I don't even know what's happening this weekend. I really don't even know anymore. <laughs> I guess I I got my work cut out for me this, eve, uh, this weekend. But yes, we will be back on Monday. We'll do some more State of Decay. And uh, yeah, we'll uh, we'll punt from there, so to speak. So take care of yourselves, be good, watch out for one another, and I will see you later.